Okay, I have here a small project I worked on tonight, which was to get a Sega Genesis controller wired up to an Arduino microcontroller and have it do something with the input. In this case, it's lighting up LEDs. You can see if I push multiple buttons, it will light up multiple LEDs, so it's able to read several of them at once. Uh, the LEDs are being shared amongst the buttons since I only have five LEDs, but I think it kind of gives the idea. And uh, this is really easy to do. The Sega Genesis has a 9-pin D-sub connector, just like you have on a computer serial port. It's really easy to get parts to connect to that. I built my own adapter here, wired to the Arduino, so I wouldn't have to cut the cable on this Genesis controller. Uh, reading the pins is pretty simple. Uh, all the information can be easily found on the internet. If you look at my source code, I've got the links in there that I used to get that information. It's just a matter of providing power and ground to the Genesis controller and then wiring the remaining pins to the Arduino to determine which buttons are being pressed, whether they're high or low, and uh, which bank you're currently reading, which is controlled through what's called the select line. Not much to it really. Um, it was a fun project. I'm looking forward to doing more with it. Uh, it would be nice to use a video game controller to do more than just light up LEDs. Although I think I'll probably use something different. I'm not real fond of the Sega Genesis controller. Uh, growing up it seemed like they just weren't as reliable. We had to replace them a lot. This one, the left D-pad's a little sticky, and the first one I tested, the B button was completely failed. So, I've actually got some PS2 controllers coming, which will be a lot more interesting since they have analog buttons and the joysticks. And there's a real good Arduino library written for interfacing with those. But this was a good way to get started. Hope you enjoyed it, and if you have any comments or questions, let me know. Thanks.